Hello and welcome to Las Vegas, or should I say welcome back, because we're back in Las Vegas in the Gen 4 car, just like the Diet Dr. Pepper series recently. Official racing has now gone to Vegas, and we are going to jump into qualifying here. Track is much slower than we had for that race, however. I'm going to put my all-time optimal up, and my best time I got from that was a 29.4 and uh, we're barely getting below 30 here I've uh, only been able to do that once get below 30 seconds and uh, just to reconfirm the track conditions for practice here I went out and ran a 30.0 and that was the fastest anyone got in their one lap or so that they were able to do so much slower track so all time optimal it's going to look like we're doing really bad in our lap, but we still be, could be doing okay. Just would like to have that uh, up there still, anyway. I think, uh, middle-ish line works pretty well for the for, uh, one and two. Had to lift at a bad time there. We'll get a 30.0 though. Should be okay. I think I could do better. However, I think the second lap you might get a little bit of extra grip once the tires are up to temp a little more. Okay, this will be better. Plus, I can cut this little bit right here. 30.051. Right, and we're hanging third, but at least we reinforced it a little bit, perhaps. I'm okay with that. I'm. Uh, this is a 3.8k strength of field. Had over 100 people signed up, so... As you can see, we're the number 7. Tough competition. So I will take a P3 for now. Seems like we're doing alright. And we'll do a little practice pit stop. That was a little easy on, but I do anticipate, of course, the tires to wear out a bit. So I kind of want it to be a little bit easier in. But that should do it. We got Josh in this race. Wished him luck. How'd he do qualifying? He's 15th at the moment. Very large field. I guess not very large, but large field. 27 cars. And, uh, not too far off. You can see very close on the times up here. We'll, we'll roll in P3 right now. Though we still have guys like Lewandowski qualifying, I'm sure. Or not. Maybe he'll start in the back. But we could definitely uh, drop down to fourth. I'm okay as long as I'm not P2. <laughs> as long as I'm not P2, I'm just fine. In fact, we had a tie right here. Look at that. Fifth and sixth tied at 127. Just very, very close times. Pretty much all the way through here. You can see just a tiny bit added as you go down the list. Another tie right here. Going to be interesting. Highly competitive field. Hopefully we get another uh, highly skilled field like we did at uh, Indianapolis last week. That was a great race. This is not the Monday night race, but a pretty strong race here on Wednesday. And of course, there's Lewandowski getting the getting the pole, so we will drop down to fourth. And uh, well, we still got the five, the eleven. They could still uh, jump us here. I could see the five getting a faster lap number two, putting us fifth. But I don't think we're dropping too much farther, so I'm okay with that. Hopefully we'll find ourselves some room around us and won't run into any trouble. Ooh, that worries me a little bit. <laughs> the 17. I don't know him, but he has qualified P7. A 1.7 safety rating. A little low, a little concerning. And uh, usually when you see a uh, high car number near the top of the field qualifying, 
That means that they are not often able to finish That's the up there. P4. And that usually means because they get into some accidents. But I could be wrong. Could be other circumstances. Just uh, someone I'll give a little extra room and I'll keep an eye on just in case I need to uh, let them catch a slide or whatever else may happen. You never know. Just good to know who's around you. That's why it's helpful just to know. Start to know people <laughs> you're racing against. Like, I know I can race close with Lewandowski. It'll be Old fine. Top five ran 30 flat. Damn. Yeah, look at that. 30 flat all through the top five. And they put uh, P6 is tied. <laughs> yeah. Very close times, like I was talking about. One left to green. Oh, yeah. Line up on the outside. Closed. Pit road is closed. It's crazy how first 20 seconds are all within, like, three tenths of each other. No. Three and a half tenths. Yeah. Man, good kid. Definitely a stack split, that's for sure. 3.8k? I got you, Memo, by the way. That's a slip I ran, only good for 18th, sheesh. Yeah, wish of luck again, in different words, essentially. Um, it might help him out not to be in the uh, dog fight right up here. So, all right. You have two additional sets of tires for this race. 80 laps. And have a good run. Just barely over 40 on fuel, so we'll have to make sure we pit just about halfway. The track temp is 115. The air temp is 78 Fahrenheit. Can't spin the tires either. Always got to be ready for that. We need to follow car number 02. In the outside what that's car. about. I don't like seeing someone goofing around already, to be honest. But who knows what that was for. We're going to save fuel. Since we can barely make it as is. But I do want to reconfirm what gear I need to be in. Why does it sound like someone's burning fuel? I don't think that's a good idea. I think you're going to want as much as you can spare, but maybe that's just me. Second gear start should be. We'll be ready for it. Ready to modulate that throttle so we don't break loose and kill the field. That would be bad. This combo worked out well for us in Gavin's uh, Dr. Diet Dr. Pepper series, but we can't just assume it'll work out well here. I guess I still got to do everything I need to do. About to go green. Stay focused. All right. Lewandowski with the jump. Okay, Gary's in for the lights. Green, green, green. Car inside. not being very patient, but that's fine. I had a little bit of a slow start. I was just being careful. People will get around us, but that's fine. I didn't spin myself out. I'd rather lose a couple spots on the start than spin myself out. Tire spin wasn't really uh, too big of a deal there. It's good to know. I'm actually planning on backing out just a little bit more. on entry here for this race than I did in the uh, league race. It's because the track seems to be a bit tighter with these different conditions, so. Could potentially be harder on the right front.
So far so good. We've kind of got it single file. I like that. No reason for anything to be too crazy so far, though. While I say that, we've got two white. And we got a red. Holy shit, I don't know how I didn't hit that guy. Alright, we'll save some more fuel. You have to be mentally retarded to stick your nose down. into the fucking rear of the car. Yeah, sorry, my ass. You need to pay attention to this. Closed. Race cars out. Line up single file behind car. So, not say a uh, very great start here. Looked like we were doing okay, but then they found a way to wreck back there. But Josh made it through. You should know because we'll get jacked. Looks like he's okay. Some other guy's not so okay, though. Sounds like the six is one of them that is not so okay. Pit roads open. Pits are open. So just let me know if you want to learn a lesson next time. Or did you learn it now? Alright. Definitely can't pit. Only two sets of tires for this whole race. Just started this thing, so not gonna want to pit. Obviously nothing we can do with fuel. And of course we'll have people kinda pretending to pit maybe. I don't know. Not really. But he's going back and forth a lot. Road that was a pretty quick two to green at least. Under Won't be that long of a caution for us. We'll start on the outside of row number three. I did my math correctly. We'll see if we can get a better start this time. However, tires could potentially be a little slippery compared to the first time, so I'll probably underdo it again. But, but like I said, we'd rather do that than uh, spin up the rear tires. Create a big mess. In fact, we'll try. Yeah, it pulls to the right a little bit. Just a tiny bit, but enough where I might have to watch it. The guy with the A1.7 is starting directly behind me, so hopefully he doesn't run me over because I'm not going 110% on lap 6, or I guess what will be lap 7 heading to 8. Again, don't know him. So, just uh, trying to be careful. But what's uh, going on around me? One left to green. You're on the outside this time. All right, Colton, get ready. Race will resume at the end of this lap. If we go green from here, I'll probably just uh, head to lap 43 or so. Since we lost some laps to caution. And uh, we want to let the guys that are going to pit on lap 40 do so. So if they mess that up and bring out a caution. We are not caught somewhere we don't want to be caught. Give it another try. Hopefully we can keep it green this time. Not quite Indianapolis where it went green all the way. It's still time for this to be a good race. The pace car is in.
Alright, still not quite as fast as the guy on the inside, for example, but we're okay. Oh, we got someone getting loose onto the inside. That was a moment for him. We'll take the middle line in one and two. And we find ourselves a P4 now. Damn, fourth all the way to 20th. Yeah, Head gets a little loose. Oh my god, the guy behind's gonna run me over. I can see it. It's already gonna happen. This is gonna be a replay of freaking Michigan, isn't it? Car outside, being a little paranoid, but I do not want to be behind or it's right in front of him for too long, to be honest. Oh, too bad though. He's following him through. He's still gonna be behind me. I'm driving in fear. Probably not the best way to do things, but I don't want to die again. Oh, that's just getting away a little bit. Oh, my God, he's so close behind me. I'm trying not to pay attention to it, but been run over from behind so many times in this series already. Jesus, so close to me. And I guess I'm close to the guy ahead too, but like... I'll run the middle line, get a run maybe. Watch out on the front, car on the front, car on the wall on the front. The car outside. Stay low, there was a car on the high side. Clear high. So, I'll let you get ready again. He'll hold me off. Tried to get the nose down there. I think it was. I saw a low car in the wall. Ah, keep up. P3 though, looking pretty good so far. Some of y'all are just gonna run out of tires. Dude, these things just, they're loose on you around here. Guy behind has backed off a little bit, he's not quite making me as nervous as he was before. Easy on that transition. Pulling the car to the left. Man, he's really slow mid corner. Maybe he's saving tires better than I am by doing so. We'll find out. Desk is not driving away or anything, at least. Still just right on the four. Really, nine? Nine. Frustrating that individual. What did I do? Oh, 
Oh god, he's real close to my bumper again. Loose. Just gonna let the 17 go. Why is he pushing up in them? Oh, here. Alright, well, I was gonna let him go, but then he, like, pushed up in the tri oval somehow. Thankfully, he lifted off and didn't just run into me, but here, here, okay. That's fine. I didn't. He was making me nervous anyway. With the three by as well. Ooh, close racing, but we're doing all right. Oh, seventeen kind of closes the door on the three a little bit. Really close. I don't know if three was there or not. 17 decided that he wasn't. Is that lap traffic we've got up there already? I think we, we gained a car up here. I could be wrong. Ooh, nice little screen flash. Just add a little bit more to the heart rate. Yeah, we've got a lap car kind of just sitting in the way. 27. Okay. Get around him. He was kind of holding a low line. Three and four, the other lap. Made me a little nervous. Grand four, you just get no grip over there. You get like a four tire slide, feels like. Kinda back that down a little bit more. Whew, alright. Take the inside here too, I'll let you go. Just still hanging in there, negotiating some spots. He wants to be here at the end of lap 80. Me too. Ooh, a 17 under the wall. Yikes. Why are we three wide? Why can't that guy just wait for me to get around the 17? It's <sighs> alright, we're okay. We're fine. I feel like the five just made himself slower by not waiting, because then he got really low on the inside and then just had to back off so he didn't push up into 17. I feel like if he just followed me through, he would have been through faster. But he's got better tires, I think, anyway. He's going to come past me once he figures out getting past the 17. Oh my gosh, they're running into each other on the straightaway. Sorry, five. I... I lost, but it's my bad. That's a bit of a weird one. I got loose out of four right there. Their contact gave me some breathing room. I'm going to start using a little bit of brake on entries. Car's getting a little tighter. Okay, Colton. Cup time's pretty consistent. Still pr plenty loose on exit, that's for sure. Tire's just going away.
fire still should be able to catch me. If I get the angle in the corner there. We're in good spot though. We're in P4. P4. Yep. Thank you. Thank you. That's what I just said. <laughs> We're in P4. In the top five here. A little bit of room behind us, but not too much. I still think the five's going to catch us, but we might be able to stay ahead of the eight and so on back there. Not sure. I haven't really seen too much uh, what their times are looking like. Just gonna try to hit some good laps right now. Keep it down low by the white line. Keep smooth on the throttle. Got a little loose there. P2 got into the wall. Looks like. Just gonna let the five by when he gets here. He's clearly much faster at this point. They're really fighting for position up there in second. It really looks like the guy's trying to get the nose on him. Pushing a little bit. Lose too much time. Still point six back to the next guy, so okay there. Is he taking that middle line one and two? You good run off? Maybe that's where I ought to be. I don't know. I feel like that would be worse on the right front, however. Really wants to turn left on this uh, tri oval. Guess it's good if it wants to turn left, but <laughs> a little too eager. Getting close to pit stops. I don't want to make the call too early. Like I said, about lap 42, 43. We'll see what everyone else around me does. Probably don't have all that much fuel left. A little leaker on the throttle. Got it sideways. Oh, we still have 11 laps. That's a decent amount. mid corner there a bit of a new feeling your tire might be hurting a bit we'll see what we uh, have for tire percentages once we get uh, into the pits I run about a lane higher here like the uh, guy ahead that's all right pretty much the same as last lap in terms of speed Still top five though, the 17's coming back to us. Or, you know, coming up to us, I guess, is the right way to put that.
You'll need to take care of the tire. Oh wow, we've got a tire warning. I wonder what they're at. I feel like that must be the right front. Wall taps ahead, maybe. Very light ones. Just done a thirty-two point two. Lewandowski dominating the race, however. Everyone kind of just following him at the moment. All right, head pitting. Looks like it. He's going to be your first taker. Before halfway, despite some caution laps. Good payoff for him, though, with a little extra speed. Five getting very loose up ahead. He smoked the tires even. Oh, hang on. You're halfway up. You estimate five. Looks good, bro. On this tank. We're going to come in not this lap, but the next one. Give those guys a chance to wreck on the way to pit Don't entry. I don't think we have too many takers though. Maybe we go one extra. You know what Josh said, but it sounds like there was something on pit entry. I heard those words. So I'm waiting a little bit. There could be complications. Guys getting on pit road. Coming in this time by... Pitting in this time, pitting in this time. Man. The lead is fitting now. Dowski pits in, we get on pit road. I think we had a nice pitting this time. entry. Pitting in this time. Five. Pitting, pitting. Three, two, one. Right here. Alright, pretty good stop. 33-37. Wow, tires are roasted. Taking this time. Good to know. All clear, punch it. Just trying to have one tire left remaining. Leaders can't go much longer, so hopefully we can get back on the lead lap for too long. Better. Holy hell, my right front was at 24. At least I'm not the worst out here. <laughs> Tire wear. That's good. This guy's pitting ahead. Gonna have to go around the outside. It's fine. Got that figured out. So I was on the right front a little bit. Track definitely harsher on the tires than uh, under lead conditions. Good to know. Still gonna try to give the right rear workout, but maybe I'll use brake on entry the whole run this time. Just a tiny bit.
Come out right behind the five. And a little bit of time on him. Just a little bit. But he'll have slightly better tires as well. Leader that stayed out. Just now coming out. We uh, will overtake him. See where this cycles out. I hit the apron, maybe. I'm gonna let the 17 go if he comes up on me. I want to save tires better this time. I think I overdrove it, being afraid of him. Part of that last run. So let me not make that same mistake again. I think we should be able to get around him once more if we're better on the tires. some laps. Car feels better now, of course, with the fresh tires. A little less of a handful. Back in the top five. Good. Six there. Bit of an awkward spot as he's coming out of the pits. You've just done the This McDonald's guy is not making it very easy on guys getting around him. Get below him here, though. Shouldn't be much of an issue. Seventeen. Oh, it's close to me again. He had to get around the lap car. Got up bundle of cars up ahead. These are all guys uh, on the lead lap too. These are guys that are ahead of us. Just all clustered together. Lewandowski is somehow even more gone than he was before. So he definitely did not lose anything. Pit stops. Is that him way up there? Jeez. I think this will help. I think having the break at the start of the round will help. We'll see for sure, but... This guy's also pit before me. I got fresher tires. So that's pretty interesting. Like this. Checked up for it, so another 17 is going around. What are you doing? Did the three, three freaking send that three wide? What a moron. Is that why the 17 came up on me, or did the 17 just not turn in? That. I don't know how that was. Either way, it's stupid, whatever someone did there. Somehow it was even a 0x. That easily could have been a crash. They're wrecking each other now. Had to get out of it. 
We're all right. That was a scary moment we had. The 17 in our door. All right. D6. Thinking the three of Lucas Cram. Lucas his way into the inside line. Get it? Because I could have said Cram, but I said Lucas. Very funny. But I don't know for sure. I'm sure we'll see it. It was probably contact enough to show up in the incidents later. I don't think it damaged us. I hope not, anyway. The car feels okay. But certainly lost us some time. Just like having to slow down for the guys wrecking each other, like, three milliseconds later. Also had to slow down for that. We're on equal tires with the next two guys ahead of us. Then the three's got two left fresher tires. Guy behind, that's a lap car, not a big deal. Okay, so the next guy on our uh, on the lead lap, the four, he's on four lap older tires, so I don't think we uh, should have to see much more of him. Unless I really blow the tire run here. Catching these guys though, all of a sudden. I don't remember seeing the nine bunch in the first run. He might have just benefited from me having to slow down for all that stuff. Whoa, lap car behind us went high line. Caused me to have to go look at there because I thought he was crashing. I glanced up there and it got me loose. I gotta focus on my own stuff instead of whatever's going on back there. Okay, I do have to focus on that though, because I'm now approaching that, which just happened there. That which occurred ahead of us. V6. It's super loose. Which is hard staying on, uh, staying ahead of us. It's fine. We'll choose our battles. He's clearly got not so great tire situation going on, though. Seems like his rear tires are really hurting. So if we're patient with this, I think we might be able to get around him some point. Hopefully he doesn't self-spin it directly in front of me beforehand. Do you think braking from the start of this run was a good call? Just helping out with that right front. I'm now maybe getting the wall on the straightaway. Don't know if that was net code or not. Aww. Didn't even think about that. That sucks. Now it's gonna turn into a bloodbath. That was a good, that was actually a really good run. First time I've had green flag stop uh, in Gen 4 Cup so far. Yeah, that's true. It was a good run. Yeah, that was really fun. It's a shame it had to end, but... What was your guys' right front after, like, your right side after that? I was at 24.37 after that last run. As a 52-48. Lewandowski, 40-40. Of okay, course it was. Okay, so I was, I killed my shit trying to keep up with the guys in front then. I don't know how they do it. I, I, I figured out uh, some method uh, during this run that I figured out was actually working. Got a lot of. Me, so I'm Catch curious to, do here. to go into what my tires are going to be like. I, I know how to keep them even now, I just don't know how to wear them the way they do and get that speed out of it yet. Full course yellow, pits are open. 
Yeah, it takes it. Hey, you're not gonna get it right away. I mean, I'm sure those guys have been doing it for years now. Oh, it's, oh yeah, we got some really good guys. For me, it's just lobby, being willing yeah, to like, drive off the right rear even, as as once you get midway to of end of the corner, so that way you're wearing the right rear as that, much as you're wearing the right front. The right front's inevitable. Oh yeah. yeah. So. Uh, pack is in four, by the way. Watch your speed. The leader, Lewandowski, is pitting. You got plenty of fuel. Everyone's pitting, of course, for their last set. Oh shit, we got people fanning out. That's gonna be interesting. No, in. really, we do. Five, <sighs> that sucks. Three, two, one. Right here. Couldn't see my box very well. Dude, twenty laps on that run. I, there's already a big difference from how my tires were. I don't think I we mean, have anyone standing out, do we? On the right after 20 laps. Those are lap good, cars. But not fast enough. Go, go, go! You are out of time. Almost beat the two. We had a bad stop, though. Racing, auto fuel Entered the box too slowly. Kind of it. Lewandowski? Oh no, he had a bad stop. Good that stinks, good he's been dominating this race. Side of things, but, uh... There's a thing you, you can, in your uh, configuration file, turn it off so it's not turned on automatically. Well, I don't know. I feel like once I reckon should do it like they do with like pit road limiter and like racing line and stuff. Once you get to a certain class, auto fuel's gone. You can't use auto fuel anymore. Like after D class, you should not be oh, able to use it. Well, where are we gonna be here? One, two, three, four, five, sixth place, it looks like. How many people stayed out? Chill. I think those are wave around cars. Yeah, they're either lappers or wave around. They're, there's nobody on the lead lap that stayed out. Okay, that's good. I'm very happy to hear that. Dude, actually, my last run was really good. I'm at 100 on all of my tires, you know? Well, it's going to be a sprint to the end now, I think. Unfortunately. It's going to be very dangerous. Very likely we get caught up in a wreck. Much higher risk now than it would have been had that gone green. That's what I mean. I hope uh, guys will be able to keep together. We'll see. I'll have to be more aggressive on the restart this time, though. At least now I know it's more stable than I thought it was going to be. We have fresh tires. Oh, boy. I'm worried. This is going to be very, very dangerous. We have 13 to go, I think. Yep, once we hit green, 13 to go. I'm not going to be too concerned about saving tires at this point, and I don't think anyone else is either. One to go. Next time by, line up on the outside. Line up behind the nine. At the end of this lap. E6. It'd be great just to finish ahead of my car number or at my car number. And I think we can do that so long as we just <laughs> survive the end of this race. Everyone's on equal footing now. They've got equally grippy pairs of shoes on. So. Anybody feel like the field's absolutely going to kill themselves on this start? Yeah, probably. Don't you put that juju on me, Ricky Bobby. <laughs> I hope so. Like, look, Six I'm is reading for chaos. I wouldn't mind People's that a lap down there, you know, so. Just like get a couple more uh, stops. Just leave me out of it. That's all I ask. If you're gonna be all chaotic, but I'm kind of in the thick of where I think it's gonna be bad. I'm at the epicenter. Get ready. Going green. <sighs> Deep breath. All right. Gotta focus. 
Post car is off. Time to do your job. Green, green, green. Inside. Still there. Stay high. Clear inside. Hey, get the runoff so we can clear the 17. Loose there. I got loose. I did not expect him to take the middle lane there. Cut down. Bobbled again. Gonna get it inside. Powers out there, but we still got a nose on him, okay. He's battling us a hard as he should. We're just losing so much time. Just trying to make one pass. It's clear up there now. Slides up. I don't know what to do. I don't know how to get around him. He's kind of protecting that middle line in one and two, which I think is what he needs to do. Figure out how to pass. Yeah, I feel like I'm gonna get more outside. Stay low, there is a car really on the high side. Really surprised the hasn't died yet. Stay low, there is a car on the high side. I can't get around him, man. I'm gonna get past because I'm trying to get around him. Stay low, there is a car on the high side. That's my reward for trying. I lose a spot. I think you just need the outside, at least for these uh, hot lap runs. Get clear. Got to pass up high, I think. Don't know about three and four, but one and two, you can definitely hit a fast lap. Oh, in that middle lane, no! Oh, saved it. Thank goodness they saved it. Let's get the screen to the end now. Okay. And then for people go right up the fucking track and the other cars that are coming at it. Yeah, 25, can't get around me, see, just run into me. Countless crash, good job, buddy. Uh -oh. Josh got Gen 4 fixed. <laughs> Listen, Joshua, I know you got turned and all, but can you try and make an effort not to come up in the other cars next time? Like, I had to put myself in the wall not to hit you. I was just trying to save it, brother. Sorry if I got in the way. Yeah, no problem. Just 
Right oh boy. Well, it might be a seventh place for us. A couple I laps to go. He just straight dumped me because he couldn't handle that. He couldn't get around me. Hey, don't block three times and then get mad when you get dumped. Hey, it's here in the race. I'm gonna block. I'm gonna fight for it. You can't find a way around clean it's just because you're talentless. You're just gonna have to deal with that. After the... God bless you, 25. God bless you. I, I wish you the best with your, uh... Whew. All right, well... Clean. Get on to the back end of the really four good. again. Uh, it's actually not. Can we go two out of that argue about this? Like, please. Thank you. Interesting. Some tires are falling off right at the last second here. Oh, the five's getting. He's hooking the three. Oh boy. Oh my goodness. What is that? White flag, no caution. What the fuck is that? I mean, seriously. Why would you take it four wide on the apron, Gen 4 in Las Vegas? Why would you just turn down and you know we're four wide top? Stupid shit. Oh, we'll get a top five out of that one. Thank you for the free positions, guys. I really appreciate it. Woo! That was wild. Oh, the wrecking. Yeah, three ways to just come Whoa. down. Oh, shit. Right P14. Yeah, you thank you guys well. for uh, killing yourselves. You know, I really needed that. I'm the last person to do shit like that. My steering's knocked out 45 degrees with the right. I can't expect where it's going to go after I get jumped in a turn one for no reason. I'm sorry. We Thomas will happily get that victory as there's Should controversy the behind. Point. That was a wild last lap. Good win, Thomas. Wow, we got to go see that yeah, right away. Top five just get used up every fucking car around me for no They were four wide in there. front of us. It's race crap. Wow. Just unfortunately, that move was just suicidal and you wrecked all of us. So I really appreciate it, Parker. Four wide on the last lap. Welcome Look at to that. I racing where everybody is just freaking out for each other. Four wide was never gonna work. I'm I mean, there's no way the I mean, five even can know. Four wide, that was fucking cool from back here. I mean, I wasn't in it, so thanks for doing that. I agree with Josh. Why is my mute button not working? Yeah. There we go. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't really want to hear them argue. Wow, look at that. Last lap, they're four wide. I knew something was going to happen. So you'll see, I actually was easing into the corner. I see that they're running into each other, so I'm just getting on the brakes at this point. I knew here that I needed to cut down. So I break enough that I can get enough grip to turn, and I'm just working hard, turning the wheel hard to get down to the bottom. Thankfully, it doesn't come down and get me. We're able to get around that mess. Because if I had just hung it out on that outside line behind him, I would have been in it. Excuse me, sorry I got the hiccups all of a sudden. Apparently that scared me into having hiccups. So we'll go from P7. Where were we on the final lap, though? Were we P7? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Yeah, P7. And then they just all start running into each other there. Gain three spots. That's not adding up. Wait a second. So we must have been P8. Or this guy. Okay, he was still behind us at the line. I got his car confused with the four. He really benefited from that, that's for sure. I had to back off more because they were wrecking in front of me. It helps the eight get around. But I'll definitely take it. It got us into a top five position. That was a wild finish. You can't even blame that on anyone. Probably, I mean, you could say, like, the four made it four wide on the apron. He's probably the most to blame, but it's also the last lap. And had a run. So, 
He held his line down there for the most part. Uh, not really. He kind of pushed up. But they were going to run into it in each other anyway because it's four wide and that happens so infrequently there's not even a crew chief call for it. So that is just very tough racing ending up with a crash that thankfully we were able to opt out of being a part of. You can see over half this 27 car field got some sort of incident through this race. Thankfully he was able to not be one of them. Josh got run over by somebody, but still got a 0x. We'll see what that ended up looking like. But we'll get the incidents now. Well, I'm going to find the wall. Lap 3. 20 in the back of the 6. Just runs him over. That's the Gen 4 special. Everyone's always running over the back of everybody. It's like people forget this is the arc of car body. And that you just cannot do that even a little bit. Ooh, that's a heavy hit, too. He's taken out this one, essentially. Lap 8. Two getting turned. Into the grass. It's the 20 who ran into someone earlier. He's going to go up and get the wall. 20 is being a problem at the start of this race. He's having a rough one. Ooh, okay, I don't know. That's, uh... I might be on the 27th for coming up right there. I'm gonna call that on the 27th. He wasn't quite clear. And even if he did have a clear call, you can't just you just can't cut it that close, knowing he's gonna get a run by taking the corner higher. I think you just have to leave that lane. You have to know that he's gonna... If he's not there now, he's gonna be there the millisecond later that you try to move up, so... Just clears himself on the 20. It's not gonna happen. What we got going on here? Oh, that's okay. That's the same thing. For some reason, it looked different. A second. But McDonald's gonna end up in the grass. Cool. Are you watching a different turn one than I am? Are they arguing? He literally thought my point is if we didn't wreck, he was causing a wreck anyway. But either way, I still don't understand why Bradley came down four car lengths and he knows we're four wide top, but. That's on par, so it's kind of stuck, unfortunately. Complaining the five not leaving enough room. I mean, he says he knows that they're four wide. Did he, though? <laughs> I don't know. I'm not going to participate in that discussion. I didn't participate in the wreck, so I'm not going to participate in the discussion. <laughs> I'm sure there's plenty of hurt feelings that uh, aren't going to change through this discussion anyway. So, 16's getting in the wall. And he's getting in the wall. It's the two-for-one special. Got some blinking. 27, still having a bit of a rough time. Fire's getting old at this point. Just about pit time. So we're going to speed up a little bit through the incidents. Probably not going to see too much for a minute. Us, for example, probably right about when we got that tire warning. There's the other tire on the right side, probably. You'll see, we're just going to get a ton of uh, false incidents here. It's whenever the tires hit a critical point. They show up in the incidents for some reason. Not always, but sometimes. Even Lewandowski hitting his 40% probably. 40-40 on that first run, and he gets that big of a lead. He's got this one figured out. When he's got it figured out, he just runs away from everybody. I'm glad he ended up with the win even ever after he had the uh, slower pit stop at the end, because he obviously deserved it. Guy's getting loose. Pit stops have started, it looks like. We'll try to get past the pit stops here. Then we might end up getting uh, pit entry trouble. You never know. Lap 
that 47. I think the pitch up hit stops should be done by now, so we're gonna get some wall hit. That 55. Or just gonna run over the eight. Or caused problems earlier in the race as well. I remember this happening. I didn't remember seeing exactly what happened though. They are still talking about that. 26. Drifting up in front of the four as a lap car, I think? Not sure what's going on here. Like, what is this 26 doing? He's not on the lead lap. He, like, gasses it up. I mean, the four's trying to cross under him. But, like, if you're not going to be much faster than a guy on the lead lap, don't try to pass him either. That just all didn't need to happen, and this was our late caution. That's unfortunate. Four involved in just about all the problems, it looks like. I see. So this is what uh, when Josh was blocking... And I guess the 25 had had enough. It's weird though, I, I felt like the middle lane was actually better for passing. So I feel like even though he was kind of turning low, I feel like maybe he could have entered the middle lane and gotten around him if he had just tried it. But uh, instead the answer was run into the back of Josh. Frustrating to get blocked. Don't know if that's necessarily the answer though. And then this kerfuffle. See if everyone just really trying not to end up wrecked. We got more people getting caught up in the back here. Wow. This was a pretty big one. That white flag kind of crashed. The nine's not holding his brakes. That's frustrating. He could have kept it up there if he held the brakes, but instead he wants to be down in the driving line. Didn't need to happen. Then he is in all kinds of trouble. That thing is... I can't believe it's still moving. And then I don't know what this was. They getting loose on the apron at the end there, and then the four slowing down because the race is over, and they get into each other. That's still going to count for safety rating, so glad I was able to move out of the way of that. But it got wild. Wild final restart. Thankfully, we're able to stay out of it and get ourselves a top five. Estimated 42 I rating gains in a 3.8k strength of field race. Definitely will take that. We're able to avoid a couple scary situations. Get a solid finish. So, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed that one. Plenty of action, I think. For most of this one. And, uh... I will see you next time for the next race. See ya.